What's good, y'all? This left side of the brain. How everybody doing today? I thought today I would just do a little um, quick video. You know what I'm saying? Something lighthearted, cause last few days we've been real heavy. We've been getting real deep and stuff, you know. And this is day. This is day three of the loneliness. We've been dropping videos back to back. Y'all know how we do it. We've been dropping videos back to back. So this video is just going to be like a... You know how you exercise and you have the cool down? Consider this like a, a cool down video, you know? Let's, let's rest, rest our brains for a second because... You know, we've been, getting, we've been getting it in, you know what I'm saying? We've been in the weight room. So you got to let the muscles relax. You know what I mean? So this video is just going to be real, you know, calm. Y'all just hanging with me today. Y'all going to be hanging with me today. I'm just outside, you know, walking around. There's a few people out here, you know. Sometimes it's good to get around. See sights and sounds. You know, to get your mind stimulated. Um, I was talking about cool down. How many of y'all exercise? You should be exercising like on the daily. You should always exercise. Because we be talking about um we be talking about spirituality, right? This is a good spot. I'm gonna just chill right here. We be talking about um spirituality and sipping on some watermelon with mint this is very good i went to this mediterranean restaurant how many of y'all know about that mediterranean food i didn't end up i didn't think i would be paying those 16 dollars though i went in there and i ended up paying 16 dollars because the lady she got me she was like like throwing all these um Oh, you should try this. You should try this. And by the, by the time you know it, here I am ending up paying $16. Are you coming through here? No problem. Yeah. So I, I end up paying $16. See, y'all, every time I start, these little people start coming my way. And look, I even came into a secluded spot. Damn, do I have to do I have to go into the to the cellar? To get away from these um, people, every time I start recording, they want to come. Even I bet if I just sit in here in the cellar in this area, they'll still come in here. <laughs> it's crazy, man. You try to avoid them. It's like they that, and that. And you know what I mean. And I and it's like I didn't even want this video to go in this direction, but it's like it means like how we be saying they can't exist without us. Every time I try to do a video, a synchronicity always shows his head up and I always get a message. And I was trying my best to keep this a cool, calm and collective video. It's just like y'all hanging out here with me and here and here they go. They can't live without us, man. Dang, they really love us. Give them a hand clap. They really love us. <laughs> man, they really love us. They don't got nothing better to do than mess with us. God, man, that just shows they parasites, man. But anyway, back to what I was saying. I'm, I'm in this little section by myself. Now watch. You know, it always happened. And they'll come just, they had to come up through this way. Look, they could have went, they, they could have went through the walkway up here and out that way. They just had to come through here and I was standing here by myself. But anyway, um... Just like I was saying at the beginning of the video, sometimes it's good to just meditate. Don't think about nothing. Just let it all go. No deep conversations with nobody. Just let it just, just let your brain relax sometimes. And that's why I'm doing this video right now. This is a relaxation video and also teaching at the same time. Because sometimes you just have to relax. You know what I mean? Because... At the end of the day, man, you know, it's going to be what it's going to be. You know what I'm saying? We just learning these things to safeguard ourselves from getting um, 
you know, sucked into into their world and becoming a part of their orbit. That's all it's about, man. And learning who is who so we won't fall into the traps. That's all. But anyway, just like how you have to take a break during um, weight training, you also have to take a break with this type of information sometimes. Your brain has to relax. And then when you relax, you can receive other uh, revelations because your brain won't be focused on one thing and it'll, it'll be like open. You see, we, we talked about everything up to a point, then you relax. Just like if you was in a weight room, you relax. You have, you have a cool down day. You take a day off and we talk about different subject matters. You see, one day we may be talking about organic portal females. Then you take a, a break from that. Then you may be talking about organic portal males. Then you take a break from that. It's just like when you go in the weight room. One day you work, you work in the legs. Then you take a break from the legs. And then you, then you work the arms. And then you work the chest. It's the same thing in this, um, the spiritual world, the spiritual training and exercising. Y'all want to see some girls? I know some of y'all men. I'm just pointing at her. We just having fun, just like if y'all was hanging with me. What y'all think about that? Would you talk to her? She got two kids. I really don't. I'll talk. Well, girls with women, that's like bringing in problems, though. I mean, girls with children, I mean, that's like bringing problems into your life. You know what I'm saying? But if you're just trying to. This is, this is the fellas talking right here in women, so I'm being open. Fellas, if you're just trying to hit it and move on and she got kids you know do it at your own risk but don't i wouldn't get seriously involved in it you know what i'm saying and when you hollering at these bras and they and you know they dumb and stuff man don't 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 go any deeper than you just trying to fuck and that's it man don't don't be trying to don't put your heart in that look at that little bird came by yeah don't put your heart into it man but yeah man i woke up this morning and um this is something else I want y'all to do. Another exercise to like cool your brain down. Early in the morning, right? And I think I said this in another video, but I didn't go into too much detail. Another synchronicity. I just looked at a bird and then I'm about to go into birds right now. And you know how in, um, man, that's a synchronicity in itself. But what I'm about to say is, God, now that's, See, I didn't, I don't be meaning for these videos to get, this one to get deep like that. It's like I can't help it. It's like the spirit of, of the creator, it speaks, it, it doesn't just speak through vocal cords. Even though it can just use us and talk through our vocal cords, it can speak through signs. A bird coming by is a form of a synchronicity. That's why y'all have to like, um, keep your your eyes and ears open a billboard on the street can be a sign for you how many of y'all seen that movie um they they live and the man he put the shades on and he was able to see things and it was communicating through him billboards it's that's what i mean like when you're looking for your answers it doesn't mean that it it doesn't necessarily have to come through a video like this even though this is one of the ways it comes it can come in so many different forms man through birds through animals through a horse any 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 kind of way man you just got to keep your your eyes and ears open because everything is a form of communication and i'm trying to keep this as, as chill as possible because okay now, what I was about to say, sometimes early in the morning, you should just listen to the birds. Now, I do this myself. When you're listening to those birds, they are actually talking, man. Like, and I've gotten so good at it around five and six in the morning when it's like the sun is coming up and it's kind of dark. But you can still see like the light coming in your window and you hear the birds. That's the loudest. That's the loudest point during the day. I mean, those I mean, excuse me, the birds sing their loudest during that time of the day. 
during the early or early morning. So I noticed that, that when I be sitting or laying in my bed, I can just hear the birds and I can even distinguish different types of birds. Like you'll get good at it and you can distinguish the different calls that be, they be giving. Like, and you can tell the different species of birds by their call and everything. Even though I don't actually see them, I can actually hear and differentiate. And it's almost like you can hear the communication that they're giving. And it's like, it's soothing at the same time. And then it dawned upon me, have y'all ever heard of binaural beats? I know some of y'all have because somebody had mentioned that to me in the comment section one time. Binaural beats. It's spelled B-I-N-A-U. R-A-L. If I'm wrong, please correct me. If you know more about it, please say something about it in the comment section. But anything. But anyway, it came to me that that's nature's natural binaural beats. Just listening to birds in the morning. Listening to, um, or just going on a, a nature walk. You know what I'm saying? And just sitting down somewhere and just listening to the, um, the trinkling of the water you see that water in front of me just listening to the sound of it that in itself is a form of a, a binaural beat whether you believe it or not that's soothing your brain and that's opening up um higher realms of your brain whether you believe it or not even listening to birds just concentrating on their sound and and believe it or not the spirit will speak to you through them. They have a message. I know that sounds crazy to some of y'all. I know, I know. To some of y'all, that's over your head. Man. What in the hell is that? Yo, I'm going to show y'all that. Look at that thing right there. Y'all see what's out here? Damn. I know y'all saw that. That's a, I don't know what that was. A man dressed up like a, that's some crazy stuff, man. But we, we try to, you know, stay away from stuff like that, okay? We, that's what I'm saying. Sometimes you just got to relax your brain and your mind from that foolishness. Because <laughs> if you keep thinking about this stuff, man, and you don't take a relaxation from it, it'll drive you crazy, man. Somebody had asked me one time in the comment section, they said, do you ever get depressed from thinking about this stuff all the time? And I'm going to answer that person. You can, man. You can. If you, if you focus on this stuff 24-7, that's why I be telling y'all about you need to take those nature walks. You need to go fishing. You need to take a vacation. Like when I first... Um, when, I, when I updated this new channel, that's where I was. I was at the beach. Y'all saw it. Go back to the... Um, look, somebody had to come just had to come I told y'all just had to come just had to come but anyway I told y'all like the first video on this channel go go look at that video I was at the beach and I'm going back to the beach as a matter of fact and next month I'll be in Florida so if any of y'all in Florida shout me out in the um, comment section I'll be in Florida next month I like to travel man I like I like hot areas, so I want to go down to Florida. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, man, nature, man, it speaks to you. You know, and some of y'all y'all probably never heard that before. Binaural beats through nature, yeah. I didn't get that out of no book nowhere. You know what I'm saying? That just came to me. You know what I'm saying? Like nature. You know what I'm saying? This is relaxation, man. What you think? It's for man these beautiful sights and sounds it's to relax your mind that's what it's for you know what I'm saying you this 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 place that we call earth it can be war or it can be peace it has everything here for you <laughs> you know what I mean it's 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 entrapments it's freedom it's vacation it's beauty and the beast at the same time. You know what I'm saying? Like a spider. Let me see if I can see a spider web somewhere. A spider web. You know, it spins its web 
is beautiful to the onlooker. But for the insect that flies into that spider web, that's the beast. You get what I'm saying? It's like, it's from afar, it's beautiful. Looking at the ocean from afar, it has therapeutic, uh, it has therapeutic, um, you know, functions or aspects to it. It's healing, you know what I'm saying? But to actually get into that ocean, it'll be a whole different story. If you can't swim, if sharks are in the water, you see what I'm saying? So you have to play people the same way. You be amongst them, but don't be inside of it. Do y'all get what I'm saying? You gotta, you gotta take that approach to everything. You can be around them, but don't be all up in the midst of it. That's all I'm saying. See, everything on this channel is simple, man. It's real simple applications. Very simple, like me. I'm right here just sipping, chilling, chilling, man. It's chilling. I ain't arguing with nobody. I ain't telling nobody to do this. I ain't telling nobody you can't wear this. You can't wear that. You can't say this. We only thing we do on this channel, we just say we ain't a part of that. That's all we doing. We the most peaceful people. Check this out. We like a religion without being codified or classified as a religion. We who come to this channel, we the most peaceful people on the earth. Because we, we just tell it like it is and we stay away from it and we do our thing. And we're not telling them not to do. Have I ever told them not to do nothing or don't wear? I ain't told you not to have sex with nobody, who to have sex with, what clothes to wear. Because we not about that. And I keep saying we because this platform, like I said, this channel belongs to us, the people with souls. It's a platform. You know, this is the left side of the brain channel. It's it's a free zone. And that's what it's about, man. That's the only way I can do it. Because that's how the earth is, man. That's how the world is. It, it allows you to do whatever you want to do. But guess what? It's consequences for everything that you do. And we still chilling. I told y'all it's going to be a chill day. We still chilling. I didn't think I would see a spider web, but that go one right there. Can y'all see that? I was just talking about spider webs. That go one. Can y'all see that? Do I have to get closer? Y'all see it? Y'all see it? It's right there. See what I'm saying? We, 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 we in the world, but not of the world. How many of y'all have heard that scripture? In the world, but not of the world. Translation to bring it into the terminology that we deal with. You red pill and blue pill at the same time. You red pill knowing how to act like a blue pill at the same time. Better yet, that's even better. You red pill knowing how to play the part of a blue pill without actually being a blue pill. Let me explain it even better. You get what I'm saying? You you hear but you know where at the same time. Boom. That's like you taking on like the God, how he's everywhere, but nowhere. Mysterious, you hear, you walk through the crowd. They see you, but they don't see you because they can't put a finger on you. They can't say you doing nothing. They can't, it's just like Jesus when he went before Pilate and Pilate washed his hands. He said, I can't see what this man did. You know what I'm saying? We the same way. They 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 come messing with us because they need us to live, you know? We don't need them. And actually, what's taking place in this world is only temporary. They are just occupying this world just for a moment. Before you know it. We not gonna even need this channel no more. You know why? Cause all them people, they they not gonna be here no more. And that time is coming, y'all. We real close to that hour. We real close to that hour, y'all. Whether you believe it or not, we real close to that hour. I don't know if y'all have heard of the um the rapture or not. When it talks about the saints of God being um lifted out of the earth, I have a um 
My spin on that is this right here. I don't even think it's talking about people disappearing. I think it's referring to, it's metaphysical. I think what it's referring to is some of us being here and we just living caught up in the spirit. Like, we're going to get so transfixed on what we are and what we about that we're going to disappear and be like totally disconnected from this world and it's not going to even bother us. It's going to get to a point where some of us, we're going to be looking at the news and we're going to be looking at the calamities in the world when World War III break out. And we're just going to be sitting this coolest, what they say, cucumbers. We're going to be looking and it's not going to even bother us. We're going to be saying famine and starvation, nuclear war, nuclear fallout. And we're just going to be as peaceful as butterflies. People are going to be yelling and screaming around us. And we're just going to be walking around unharmed, untouched. Ravens going to be bringing us food. A deer going to come out of the woods and show us where to go. For until the storm passes over and I, I i i really hold on to that man because it gotta be that way man because when you living right remember yesterday i was um talking about certain rules in this world that can't be broken well another one of those rules is if you are living right you gotta be rewarded for it no way around it when you doing the right thing when you haven't sold your soul out, you got to be rewarded. You're going to be protected. You don't have to get a gun. You don't have to worry about being harmed by any of these people because you got protection on you. Because as long as you don't touch what has been unsanctified, something unclean, as long as you remain untainted by their brainwashing, as long as you... Because check this out if they, if they are so powerful Why haven't they just came and just killed all of us They know who we are They know everything They see what we doing They see you watching these videos They see me posting these videos But it's, it's a thing That they cannot touch us Because we are the elect And it don't matter what race you are You can be black, white, Asian It's a spirit of truth Within every race of people in every race of people, the blacks, the whites, the Asians, the Spanish, the Arabs. It's, it's somebody that recognizes real within every man on this planet. And those are the people that they are not going to be able to touch. And guess what else? It's only a few. It's not many. It's only a few. The cho That's why they call it the chosen few. I'm sorry, y'all, if this video got too deep, man. I, I was trying to keep it cool and calm, but sometimes I, I think it's more light than yesterday and a few days back. I'm just trying to keep it relaxed, you know, but sometimes it gets like that because, you know, the spirit gets to moving and I have to be the vessel that I am, you know. But changing the subject, changing gears for a second, um, let's talk about exercise. Um... We talked about the binaural natural beat from nature. We talk about, okay, let's talk about um, exercise now. Now, one of the healthiest exercises that you can do is sh shadow boxing. Y'all didn't think I would say that, did you? And I'm gonna tell you why. I'm gonna tell you why I do, or better yet, taking up some type of martial arts. Or boxing class and learning how to do shadow boxing and I'm gonna tell you why okay yeah you look cute I know <laughs> y'all I just did that for the for the for the men watching we just having fun you know it's oh my god this lady got a shirt on that says just kicking it and I just said I did that for the men watching and said we just having fun Look at this lady right here. It just said, just kicking it. I told y'all, man, this stuff is real. In every one of my videos, it be synchronicities. That's the second one in this video. Another thing. See, I didn't mean for this thing to get deep. When you talking about something, and this is how you can 
tell it for yourself if it's coming from the right source. It'll be a whole bunch of confirmation after confirmation after confirmation confirming what it is that you are saying. That's how the spirit works. And I didn't I didn't mean for it to get like this. I was trying my best, but the spirit controls everything. You know, I, I think it's still cool though. What y'all think? Y'all tell me. But take up some type of um martial art. Take up some type of martial art. And the reason why is I shadow box. And my arms, man, are real cut. My abs. I got six pack, my um, my leg muscles, my thigh muscles. I'm, I'm in shape. And I also have an ab wheel that I use. And the reason why you should exercise because it keeps you youthful. I'm gonna give y'all a secret about exercise that you probably never heard before. One thing about exercise, man. See, the body doesn't know age. Time is something that you are taught the body doesn't know age somebody told you that you had a birthday when you was a kid you wasn't thinking about the day you was born nobody even that wasn't even in your mind you wasn't thinking about i'm gonna die one day none of that type of stuff okay so time is something that's taught to us it's another part of the programming time is only relative to this third dimensional realm that we live in now this video is not about time i gotta even put the brakes on myself because i can go into a lecture about time and all i'm not trying to do that but i'm just trying to stay you know just cool we cool now time is one of those things that makes a person age because you're stressed and you worry and you're living on this timetable in this organic portal realm where you have to get up at a certain time You have to do this at a certain time You're trying to cram everything Within a certain time frame So you're limiting yourself Because you By doing that you are um, Basically Admitting that You got a certain amount of time So your body It works in accordance to what You admit to You see it goes back to What I was saying Everything is subject to you in this realm. Okay? So, one thing about that exercise is you trick the body into believing that it can keep going forever. You got to see the muscles don't know an age. They just they operate it's like this. You got hundreds and thousands of muscles in your body. If you don't use them, they're going to lock up. Just like anything else, if you leave a car in the garage, what do you think gonna happen to an end to the engine? It's gonna lock up. So the same with your body, man. You have to exercise it, man, woman. Since I've been blamed lately for being a misogynist and all, because it's some. That's why I hate certain people, man. That just like this call stuff because they don't. If you if you don't like it, if you just don't even listen, you know what I'm saying? But man or woman. This is for both, man, because it's good women out here and it's good men. If you don't exercise, it's going to lock up. Your body is going to lock up. Just like a car, if you left it in the garage for years and years under a canopy, what's going to happen? It's going to rust. It's going to lock up. The same thing with your body, man. Your, your bones and stuff will get rigid. So what you have to do, you have to trick your body into thinking that it's younger than it is exercising itself is a form of meditation you're basically tricking the own cells in your body you can take control of your mind and say I'm, i want to stop the aging process you can say that to yourself how you think them monks and them gurus be living all those years that's the secret they practice in mind over matter that's all they doing they, they just practicing mind over matter and that's how they able to live to be them you know them long ages like that and that's what you got to do you got to exercise you got to stretch you got to do yoga and here's a, here's a tip on yoga you don't even have to join a yoga class to do yoga i'm not saying don't join a yoga class you can research some things you can learn a few um 
what is it called asanas i guess that's what it's called for the postures um asanas you can learn a few breathing exercise techniques and guess what else you might start out researching it but if you really start meditating on your own guess what else those exercises will come to you naturally you will naturally create your own breathing exercise routines you'll naturally create your own yoga techniques because guess guess how i know guess how i know because i do the same thing i do the same thing you you will be able to create your own martial arts because you got to say to yourself how did these practices begin in the first place it wasn't always a book that somebody had to go by all of these different styles of uh Kung Fu and um, all these different yoga practices and stuff They didn't always have a book to go by You know what I'm saying? They had The the original For instance You know who started um, You know who started Kung Fu? Kung Fu was really a um, Like a, a yoga exercise Guess who started it? Y'all thought Kung Fu came from Asia From China, didn't you? It didn't come from China Guess who started it? It came from a black man from India by the name of Bodhidharma. Bodhidharma. It didn't, it didn't start with the Asians. It didn't start in China. What it, what it was, he was like a missionary. And he went over to China. And he started teaching the, the Buddhists over there. That's where they adopted the techniques of Kung Fu from. And they had what is called um, in their monasteries. They first started learning it in the Shaolin Temple. That's, and that's, it was passed down from Bodhidharma. And you can look it up for yourself. They even have a statue of him, you know, at the Shaolin Temple. He was the first grand master teacher, bringer of the Kung Fu martial arts. Bodhidharma. Look that up. Bodhidharma. And like I said, man, if you get more in tune with your higher self, your higher self will coach you through this thing, man. It'll give you the exercises to do. You know what I'm saying? All these um different styles of Kung Fu, that's where it came from. Cause you know, the Buddhists, they do a lot of meditating. A lot of meditating. That's where they got they um they exercises from. <clears throat> yep. So that's just a, a lesson today. <laughs> Something else I wanted to say. Um and when you exercise and eating too, man. Since we just cool and we're chilling. Eating too, man. When you eat, you don't have to follow the, the food pyramid. Pyramid like that. I eat according to my conscience. It's certain things you shouldn't eat. Like me, I don't eat no pork. I'm on a no pork diet. But some people get so strict about diet that they feel like that they create a kryptonite in their own mind. And they make certain foods become a kryptonite. So if they eat those foods, they will gain weight. Or get sick or be unhealthy because they told themselves that I can absolutely not eat this. When you start doing stuff like that, you are telling your mind that these certain things have power over you. Now, I'm not saying that you should not do everything in moderation or watch what you eat. I'm just saying you don't have to be so strict. The key is moderation. Because... Ultimately, everything in nature has some benefit to it. Anything you eat has some type of benefit to it. Not saying eat rat poison. <laughs> I'm just saying like everything has some type of benefit. And if you get too strict and rigid, you'll break. Anything that's too rigid, it breaks. So you have to be flexible. With your lifestyle, man. You can't get so strict. You can't get so strict and religious. Y'all man, y'all wanna see some more women?
Yeah, just looking, you know, just sightseeing. Sometimes you can look at women from afar. You ain't even gotta, you ain't even gotta approach them, man. Sometimes you, when you just chilling, man, you just in a, you in your zone. You just looking. Just hey, ain't nothing wrong with en enjoying the sight of a woman. That's needless to say, you know what I'm saying. So don't think that on this channel that I'm telling you to not be a man, not to have fun. I'm just saying. If you're going to have fun, if you're going to do these things, be a red pill and know the how to be a blue pill. Some of y'all don't know what a red pill and blue pill is. I'm just saying that like everybody knows. A red pill is one who has taken the, the reality pill of truth and you understand like the veil has been removed. A blue pill is one who is under the the hypnosis of this matrix i.e. organic portal realm so that's what it is man and what i'm saying is you don't have to be so rigid loosen up man loosen up have fun you know play video games skateboard go swimming live but but don't sell out that's all i'm saying stay righteous and live at the same time. You know what I'm saying? We, we don't, you don't have to be all like living like a nun. And I don't wear no certain uniform. And you know, walking around like Muslims in a veil and all of that. Making people know what you are and all of that. You don't have to do all of that, man. That's just, none of that stuff don't impress me. When I see people, you know, a Catholic priest with the... The white collar and the black suit on and that don't impress me because you can you can walk up to some of them people like the muslim women with the veils and they got face covered and that don't mean nothing that don't mean you righteous that don't mean you holy we not with all that form and fashion all of that putting on an appearance of righteousness but your heart is still black and dark and and you still an organic portal so what Nine times out of ten, if you follow a religion, you in a you an organic portal anyway. I did I did a whole series on um organic the organic portal religious systems. For those who haven't seen that, you need to go back and watch that. This lifestyle, man, it's about freedom, man. The only true freedom. Oh, damn, I know y'all like that. Check that out right there. Jesus, the one in that gray. I know y'all like that. <laughs> I know some of y'all. Ain't nothing wrong with that, man. If you like it, just comment on it. Now, we know she an organic portal. Let's just be real. She an organic portal. You know what I'm saying? They not on this type of stuff. You know what I'm saying? Hey, miss. You look nice today. Would you, would you like to say hey, yo, hey? I got a YouTube channel. It's a sports channel. Oh, you not okay? I, I was gonna get. I was gonna let her say hey to y'all. Yeah, but um, y'all know, man. That's all I'm saying, man. Just you gotta just loosen up, man, and just and just have fun out here, man. Don't don't take life too serious, man. Well, take life serious, but don't get so um, you know um, don't get so caught up on um trying to live up to some type of standard that don't exist because who are these people to impress man look at this world man this world is crazy man oh yeah and i got a treat for y'all tonight i gotta i'm gonna do a video tonight i got a treat for y'all tonight and you see how i told her that this, this was a sports channel because i knew the type of person i was dealing with that's what i'm telling y'all man I knew what I was dealing with. If I would have said, this is a uh, channel about this, some of y'all would have did that. But y'all, you're not, you, you got to be wise, wise as a serpent out here, man. You can't deal with these people like that. Now, if I was talking to one of y'all, if I seen one of y'all in public that be in the comment section, then I can come at you real. But with, but with a woman like that and these people like that, I got to practice that being a red pill and a blue pill at the same time. That's what I'm saying. Like, who are these people to keep some type of standard for, man? We ain't got to... As a matter of fact, y'all gonna see me with that costume on, man. I'm gonna get me... 
a Bugs Bunny outfit. I'm going to be walking around in public around them. I don't care, man. These people ain't nobody to be trying to um, live up to, man. They crazy, man. They be doing all type of stuff. Getting sex operations, changing their sex from male to female. These people nuts, man. They doing whatever they want to do out here. And it, it's us righteous people that's out here trying to uh, live up to some type of code or something. That don't even exist. We in they world under they system, man. I'm not trying to live up to that to their standards, man. These people, man, they they not even worth it, man. They ain't worth it, man. They ain't, they not trying to change and reshape for us. If they crazy, man, they doing all that crazy stuff. When I'm around them, I mean, I ain't got to act crazy, but at the same time, I'm not trying to be all polite and all and trying to live up to this. No, man, because this world is crap, man. We ain't got to do that, man. We just we we follow the laws. We take care of what we got to do. We take care of our responsibilities. If you so happen and slipped up to have a child before you started listening to information like this or before you, you know, heard about left side of the brain, now you know, then that's a different story. But now you do know, so you're not going to make that mistake now. You see what I'm saying? That's what I'm talking about, man. We have to be we have to be wiser than them because if we thinking just like them then what is all of this for you see what i'm saying we can't be thinking like these ordinary people man we're not ordinary and i'm gonna leave it i'm gonna leave it with that we are not ordinary let that marinate and i hope you enjoyed the video and got something out of it this is left side of the brain signing out peace